Well, we have got a, a rate cut on Threadneedle Street at the Bank of England. The previous rate was 5.25. It's 5% now. It's a 25 basis point cut. We've got some work to do from New York City this morning. Good morning, good morning. The second hour of Bloomberg surveillance starts right now. Economists in our survey were looking for it. They were looking for a split decision as well. And a split decision, Lisa, is what we got from the Bank of England's MPC. Yeah, what you can see right now is Green, Haskell, Mann and Pill all voting to hold rates. The other five voting to rate uh, to cut rates at a time when inflation has eased somewhat substantially talking about headline inflation around two percent right now uh, even though core CPI came in at three and a half percent in June they said that they see inflation at 1.7 percent in the third quarter of 2026 and 1.5 percent in the third quarter of 2027 hello Jeff Rosenberg talking about the potential of disinflation re-emerging as a bigger risk a quarter point cut over at the Bank of England the vote Five to four, Governor Bailey cautious on cutting too quickly or by too much. The decision they characterise as finely balanced, a finely balanced decision from the Bank of England. Let's get into this a little bit more. Let's turn to the story in Sterling and get to cable. The pound right now, a little bit lower, down seven tenths of one percent, 127.66.